We are expecting uh, the Labour leader to speak any second. But they're just taking in the moment, aren't they? And it is quite a moment. day of firsts. This is the, I'm the first leader to say Labour, Selby and Ainsley. Ever. <laughs> it's the first time we've won here. It's the first time we've overturned a 20,000 majority. The biggest majority we've ever turned over in the history of the Labour Party. Absolutely. <laughs> Because I'm always saying no complacency, it's the first time ever I've been able to say, well done, Kia. <laughs> the Amazer, the MP, the new MP, fantastic. And I want to address those that voted for us yesterday directly because you voted for change. You put your trust in the Labour Party and we hear you. We hear that cry for change away from the chaos, away from those rising bills, the crumbling public services, a cry for change. And we will deliver. We will deliver through Keir Mather here and we'll deliver with the next Labour government. Yeah. Because this Labour Party has changed and what happened yesterday is vindication of that change. The priorities of working people are our priorities, and that's why people are prepared to put their trust in the Labour Party. They want a party and a government focused on their priorities of jobs, of health, of public services, of opportunities for everyone, wherever they are. So by changing our party, listening to voters, we've shown what a changed Labour Party can do. This should never have been a by-election caused by the chaos, the division, the infighting in the Tory party. And that's why so many people have said to us they want change. They want to see politics as a force for good. And we will deliver that change. We will see politics as a force for good with the next Labour government, with Keir Mather here as the MP coming into Parliament. Thank you so much. Keir. I'm going to pass over to Angelina. And I won't speak for long. I mean, a sandwich of Keirs, but it's nice to have two Keirs as Labour MPs uh, going forward. And, and it is to the thanks of the people of uh, Selby and for the trust that they've put in the Labour Party. And of course, it's in Rishi Sunak's own back garden, literally, as well, because we've shown that we can win in Tory areas as well, because the Labour Party has changed. We are listening to the voters, we're listening to their priorities and we know that they want to see an, a, a, a credible plan to take us into the future, not just for today's problems which have been caused by the Conservatives and the 13 years of their disastrous rule, but also a plan for the future, for our young people, for jobs, for productivity, for our public services that we've seen that has been completely run down after 13 years. And it's great to be in a Keir sandwich. And it's, <laughs> and it's absolutely brilliant to see so many people here today and to thank those voters who came out and gave Keir the support that they gave him. He knows he's got to work hard. He knows that it starts right now. Not get, getting elected was one thing, but actually the work starts now. And the trust that the people here have put into care and to put into the Labour Party, we say thank you and we will make sure that we make you proud so that you will vote for care come the general election and get both these cares into Parliament again and get this care as Prime Minister. So and, and, and I want to just say... A huge, incredible thank you for the work you've done, Keir, and hand you over to the new MP for Salisbury, Keir. Yeah. Thank you all so much for being here and I want to start by saying thank you to the people of Selby and Ainsty. All those yeah. people who've put their trust in Labour, many for the very first time, 
It is the privilege of my life to serve you in Parliament and I will be working tirelessly every day to repay the faith that you've shown in me. And I also want to thank all of the activists who are gathered here today because we have made history in this campaign and I am so incredibly proud of every single one of you. Overturning the largest majority since the Second World War is no mean feat, but it's a testament to the fact that we have worked incredibly hard yeah. to get out on the doorstep, spread that positive, hopeful message about what a Labour MP and a Labour government can deliver for people. And I could not be prouder of the campaign that we've delivered. I mean, when we started, Nobody thought that we could overturn a 20,000 vote Conservative majority in this seat. And through your dedication and by going out and speaking to voters and making that case, we have made it possible. People are feeling positive, they're feeling enthusiastic about the future and about the potential that a hard-working Labour MP and eventually a Labour government can bring. It is the absolute privilege of my life to be able to serve the people of Serbia and Ainsty and I cannot wait to get started. So thank you all. Yeah.